consistency and that trust of like-minded individuals gives you strength. What I've seen is that although people have left and they've moved to other places throughout the country, um, they still continue to connect with Got Jokes because that's what really separates us. It's not just people trying to get together to make money. We really are family. Family and funny family members at that. That's Perennial good. winner of Creative Loafing's Best of the Bay Award, the Got Jokes Improv Troupe is putting on a comedy show this weekend that promises to have you rolling in the aisles. Founder Daniel Motown Pride Jefferson and creative directors Chuck Glass and Barry Naylor join us today to tell us more. Good morning, gentlemen. Good morning. Good morning. Thank you for having us. Yes, yeah, so you have this big show this weekend. First thing I asked was, all right, is Irma going to push you guys out yet? Are we still planning on doing this this weekend? Yeah, we invited Irma to the show. <laughs> Irma, Irma's allowed VIP to come. seats. <laughs> we got a t-shirt for her. So let's take us to the beginning of this. Uh, your group started uh, now national, by the way. Yes. But take us back to the beginning, and this is kind of your brainchild what was your hope and mission at that time yeah so um initially it all kind of started with the conversation i had with a fellow comedian ron um hortman um and um, i was that's my my start in entertainment actually came in spoken word so i was trying to come up with a creative way for me and him to work together and um I, I was always a fan of um, Whose Line Is That Anyway? Mm -hmm. And I always thought, you know, if I had the opportunity to do that, I think I could improve the formula. And so I had this big casting call, um, and I basically advertised starting an improv troupe, financial backing, and then I was shocked. Like, I just put it like a Craigslist ad, and I literally got people from all over the, the state of Florida coming to audition for the improv troupe. Well, and the talent that's been working with you since now, I mean, name some, brag on yourselves a little bit because members are now going on to be star in TV shows, movies. Yeah, I mean, so. The level of talent is. That's right, yeah. So inside of our group over the years, uh, we're very proud. We have people who've made cameo appearances on things like Baywatch and Walking Dead, Girls Trip. Um, one, of, uh, one of the people we're really proud of is Ricky Wayne, who's done a lot of stuff all over the place. Mm -hmm. uh, we have a a great roster of people who are got jokes. I wanted to kind of become Tampa's version of a second city. Okay. And, I, and I think that we have really succeeded in doing that and we're still growing. Yeah, so well, and I kind of think of it as a traveling, I don't know, SNL cast or something. I mean, talk a little bit about the members and what it is that you, uh, you guys are doing as a team um, kind of when you're out performing. <laughs> Go ahead. Who wants we to do take so, that We one? do yeah. so much. We do so much. Because it's not just improv. No, we do stand up. Barry and I are both traveling, headlining comedians mm -hmm. around the country. We have actors. We have spoken word artists. I mean, it's we do so much more. Sketch writing, everything. Mm -hmm. So and. Uh, and you're actually joining. You're in, from your team in what Philadelphia? Is that right? right? I actually live in Philadelphia. So uh, since I'm also co-creative director, had to make sure I come back in town to get get this show ready uh, for this Saturday. Um, but I recently had a show last week, so it's a busy schedule. We'll bounce to New York to do a show and then fly back down to make sure the Got Joke show is ready. And I'm actually heading out to L.A. to do a show with another one of our cast members, uh, Char Langley, uh, Charlotte Langley. Mm -hmm. She has a show that she's doing in L.A., so going out there and helping her with that, too. So we were all over the place. We make sure we're busy. A lot of shared calendars. Okay. And Barry has been on stuff like, you know, I like brag on him. Yeah. He's been on like Sway in the Morning show. He's open for really big name comedians all over the country. So individually, I mean, it's like a who's who. Yeah. If you are a fan of the Tampa Bay entertainment scene, I feel like we've kind of cornered the market with some of the greatest talent. And what we decided a long time ago mm -hmm. is that if you bring all this talent together, mm -hmm. instead of trying to make it work by yourself, if we work together, we can make more progress. Well, and I would imagine how important is comedy these days? Where I mean, I think people really are desperate to unite in laughter, yes. right? I mean, there's a need for that. Do you see that kind of in the shows? Oh yeah, uh, some people after the shows they would come up to us and say they were having a hard, like having a rough mm -hmm. day. So pretty much after they leave our shows, pretty much that's like one reason why we mm -hmm. lo love to do comedy. So whatever is affecting you in your real life, if you can just step away from that for like yeah. an hour and just laugh with us. They will make you feel better. Laughter is medicine. It's really cool because sometimes we do venues of a thousand people and comedy, you can make a thousand people from a thousand different backgrounds, a thousand mm -hmm. different right. points of view, laugh at the same thing. 
That's amazing to me. Yeah. I think that that's one of my favorite things about this. Well, let's give ahead the, the the details for this weekend so people can come in out and see you again. Irma may be welcome as well. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, there is the come details. On. You can find out more on the website. I know you're also looking for sponsorships. You want to make sure Tampa's represented uh, well across the country. And uh, gentlemen, thank you so much for being here this morning. We look forward to, to seeing more of you and uh, hopefully have you back soon. Right, Thanks for having us. Thank Appreciate you. it.